So you want to know just how I feel about you I could live without you, just don't want to Why hair? Why? Hey everyone, it's Toby and today I have a new video for you all and before we get started with this video I just wanted to thank all of you for clicking that subscribe button because now I have over 850 subscribers that is absolutely amazing and crazy and I would just like to thank all of you because I've gained so many subscribers in the last week and a half I think and that is just absolutely mind-blowing and crazy and yes I am sitting outside so sorry if there's like background noise but that will only be for the next few seconds but um yeah just thank you guys so much that is absolutely crazy and anyway today's video is going to be a what's my backpack slash how i organize my backpack i guess even though the school year hasn't started i just thought i would show you guys what my backpack how my backpack is organized for the beginning of the year and then probably at the end of the year i will show you how messy my backpack has probably gotten. So with that said, we're gonna jump right into this video. All right, so the first thing that I have in the front little pocket of my backpack are just four packs of post-it notes. And then I just have four little pens, or they're not really little, but I have some pens. And if you guys haven't seen my back to school supplies haul yet, I will link that down below so you guys can go watch that if you haven't. And lastly, in that little front pocket, I just have three extra mechanical pencil erasers. Moving on to the second small little pocket thing, I just keep a mini stapler along with some extra little staples just in case I run out or something like that, so I like to have some extras. And then of course I have my phone, you have to have your phone, it's just a must have and a necessity, so I always bring my phone with me. Lastly in that little pocket I just have six big mechanical pencils just in case I run out or I lose some of my other pencils, so I like to keep some extra. Moving on to the bigger pocket, I just have three book covers, and since it's not the beginning of the year yet, I don't have these on my textbooks, so that's why they're just kind of hanging around in my backpack. And then I just have this cute little index card holder from Target, and it just has some colorful index cards because I love flashcards and I love studying with flashcards, so I like to keep a lot of index cards. And then lastly in that pocket, I just have some neon labels, which is kind of random, but I just have some of those in there. So now moving on to the biggest or main pocket of my backpack, I have four folders and like I mentioned before, I love color coding. Leave a comment down below if you guys are also a big fan of color coding because I know I am. And then, so the first folder that I have is just my purple history folder and I like to keep some extra binder paper just in case I need some. And then I have my green math folder and I like to use the neon labels on them like I showed before and I also like to keep a side that says to do and one that says turn in so it makes everything nice and organized and it's just easier to find everything in your folder and then I just have my yellow science folder and if I didn't mention already these are the two pocket portfolios by the up and up brand from Target most of my supplies are from Target so also my backpack is from Target I forgot to mention that so my backpack is from Target and then lastly I just have my pink English folder and it's the same as all my other folders except it's pink so that is it for my folders and now we're going to move on to my notebooks so first i have a backup black five star notebook which i've already used some of the paper from like last year but there is enough just in case i need it as a backup and then i have a white english notebook i almost said folder but i have a white english notebook and then i have a green five star notebook for math and then I have an Up and Up brand purple history notebook. And lastly, I just have a really pretty blue Up and Up brand science notebook. Next, I also have my binder in here. And I also did a tutorial on how to make this binder cover. And I am probably going to be doing one for this year as well. So I will link the previous one down below. But next, I have my pencil box, which is also from Target, like I said. And in here, I have my absolute favorite mechanical pencils. Next, I just have two extra mechanical pencils, just in case those clear point pencils, I lose them or something like that. And then I have a little white eraser, and this just came with a pack of lead that I got. And then I also have a pack of Papermate lead, and this also came with my mechanical pencils, the clear point ones. And then I just have three pens in black, red, and dark blue. 
Now moving on to my next pencil case, which is actually going to be staying in my locker because it just has a bunch of extra little things that I'm not going to be needing on a daily basis, but I will be needing on sometimes on some classes. And I actually made this one, so I'm probably going to be doing a tutorial on it most likely. But in here, I just have some scissors and these scissors are from Target if you're wondering. Like I said, everything is from Target basically. And then I also have some markers and I also have two glue sticks and these are the Up and Up brand. And I just have two glue sticks. And then lastly, I just have three packs of lead. So that is everything that is in my backpack. All right, so that's it for this video. I hope you all enjoyed. Make sure to give it a big thumbs up and also click that subscribe button if you haven't already. And if you're watching all the way to the end of this video, comment that unicorn shirt is rad because my unicorn shirt is rad. So comment that if you have watched all the way to the end. And again, thank you guys for over 850 subscribers because again, that is just crazy and unbelievable and amazing. And my memory card space is running out. So I'm going to have to talk to you guys later so i will see you all in my next video bye you're really fun and funky and cool and hip stop all these leaves keep falling in my video i guess they just want to be in my video but they're not as famous as me so good try Go i'm not actually writing anything uh um what was i gonna say now, B, let's get out of here.